G'day, Egyptians. Um, this is a VR for Tamar for her um, lighting a tinder with her lighting a fire with natural tinders. First one we've got, we're going to do I don't know, maybe ten today. We're just going to go for a walk through the bush and have a squeezy moto and see what we can find. They've got some stringy bark here. Um, my interpretation of this is she wants us to light a fire. So as soon as I have flame with my tinder, that's fire. Um, and on the last one, I'll actually build a fire anyway because I'm staying out overnight. Okay. We'll do a couple of different techniques with the ferro rod and striker as well. Alright, uh, there's our first one. Now I'll grab some paper bark for our second one. Obviously everyone's used this one before, this is the paper bar. It's my favourite. That's number two. And we've also got some bracket burn over here. Give that one a whirl. This in my bird's nest, but I never actually tried to light it. Like a pharaoh, so live and learn. It either will or it won't.
I'll just stop it there, mate. Righto, um, got a banksy tree here, give that a crack. It's got some natural sugars in it, so uh, it should burn okay. Obviously the dead one. It's a bit temperamental, but bear with me. I just tried one before off camera. Snap it in the same spot too. There we go. Oh. Flame on. Definitely another natural tinder you can use. Start a fire. I hope that's coming out in the camera. Right now, come across some grass in a bit of swampy area around here. It's all swamp around here anyway. Um, there's been plenty of water, but you can dry grass. And your fingers through it so you don't get the green stuff. Up. Not too much. Put it all together. Doesn't go to the bottom. Give that one a crack. Another successful tinder. Okay, got some native gooseberry here. We're going to try that. It's actually a flash, tin flash tinder, so that will convert it to a flame for a second, and then I'll use the grass to sustain it a bit more. We'll grab some of that. You got two strikes for the fluffy stuff, which gave us a little bit of flame, which is the flash tinder. Converted that with the grass. 
to a normal Tinder. Okay, um, a little bit of a pine pie here to come across. This is the dead bit of pine. As a few people know anyway, I don't know, um, the resin always goes to the bottom. So I reckon this here is going to be a nice, oh, yeah, piece of fat wood. But we'll go back to camp and um, process that one up and finish her off. I know. coming here for the last three weeks because we found a fresh kill from the dogs so I've just been looking at the decomposition to see uh, what it looks like week after week that's a bit further back but this is part of it so I thought I'd give it a try anyway got all the right characteristics light fluffy Bushka. and stinks Next tin, this is another flash tinder, Scotch thistle. So there's plenty of it sitting on top of here. Watch your fingers. Open one up. There's plenty inside it too. that mix it all together so obviously combine this with your grass again <coughs> but this will convert to flame straight away If I had a bit of grass and that, the grass would be going off, so let's give it one more hit. Spread him out a bit. Wushka. Okay, um, this is number nine or ten, I think. Got some cat tails here. Another flash tinder. Um, yeah, we'll just fire it up. Same again, you need something more sustainable to keep the flame going, but if it is a tinder, it will catch flame. I hope you can see all that, but yeah, there you go. Bit of grass. It should be rocking. Alright, uh, this is the end of the fat wood process, and we'll give it a go. This will be the beginning of the fire for tonight. Mm, smell that pine. Righto, well, that's the end of me Tinder challenge. Um, I'd like to thank Amber Jack for putting on the competition. I've checked out his website, it looks pretty cool. And thanks to Tamar too for, the, um, for putting the competition on. Awesome, thanks guys.